Good morning. I'm Tony Paraka, Field Applications Engineer with Kodo Technology. Today I want to introduce you to a new line of magnetic sensors based on tunneling magneto resistance from Kodo Technology. These sensors bring significant advantage to product design. Kodo Technology's magnetic sensors are the lowest power magnetic sensors available today. What that means to you is you can run a battery operated equipment or a, a product for much longer than you might be able to with a Hall effect sensor or an AMR or a GMR type of magnetic sensors. Also, Koto Technologies TMR sensors have very high sensitivity, much better than the Hall effect or the other sensors. What that means for you is your products can operate with a magnet much farther away than with the other sensors or it can operate with a much smaller magnet. That translates to cost advantage for you, or the product developer. Kodo Technologies TMR magnetic sensors are available in several flavors to address different application needs. One of those flavors is the types of output available on these sensors. So these sensors are available with an analog output. They're also available with a digital output. The digital output sensors further are available in a unipolar digital output or an omnipolar digital output and also a bipolar latching digital output. These sensors best fit into different applications based on these output configurations. Let me talk to you about these sensors one at a time. This is a demonstration board from Koto Technology showing several TMR sensors. We have an analog sensor, uh, the RR111. We have a unipolar sensor, RR120. We have an omnipolar sensor, RR121. And we have a bipolar sensor, RR121. The output of the analog sensor is a voltage output. The voltage output is proportional to the field strength from the magnet. For this demonstration, I have a cylindrical bar magnet. The silver side is a north pole and the black side is a south pole. As the north pole approaches the sensor, the output voltage drops towards zero volts, as shown by the LEDs. When the south pole is brought towards the sensor, the output voltage increases towards VDD, as shown by the LEDs. The unipolar sensor has an output that is digital in nature. It is on or off. The sensor is turned on when the north pole approaches the magnet. When the sensor is turned on, the LED is turned on. When the magnet moves away, the sensor turns off. The unipolar sensor is not sensitive to the south pole of the magnet. When the south pole approaches the sensor, there is no response. The omnipolar sensor responds to the north pole and the south pole of a magnet. When a north pole approaches the sensor, the output turns on as shown by the LED. When the north pole recedes, the output goes off. In a similar fashion, when the south pole approaches the magnet, the sensor turns on. When the south pole recedes, the sensor turns on. Because the sensor responds to the north and the south poles, it is called an omnipolar sensor. Because of the very low current consumption of Koto Technologies TMR sensors, they can be used to turn a system on or off without a substantial drain on the system battery. On this demonstration board, we have an omnipolar sensor that is used to wake up the board when it is taken out of the box. In the box, we have a magnet embedded that keeps the sensor turned on. The sensor in turn with a small circuit turns off the power to the entire board. When the sensor is separated from the magnet, the sensor turns off, which in turn enables power to the board. This wake up function is executed with minimal drain on a small battery that powers the board. The bipolar sensor has a latching output. It turns on with the north pole of a magnet and it stays on after the north pole recedes. It turns off with the south pole of a magnet and it stays off after the south pole recedes. As long as the power is maintained to the sensor, the output stays latched after a pole approaches and recedes from the magnet as shown here. So that's a very good summary of different types of sensors available from Koto Technology. The analog output type, 
the digital unipolar type, the digital omnipolar type, and the digital bipolar latching type. Each of these find applications in a range of products. And every product is different. The requirements are different, even for the same type of sensor. To address those needs, Koto Technology offers these sensors in different sensitivities, different output frequency response uh, to tailor the sensor for best use in your application. For more information on these sensors, please visit our website www.kotorelay.com. You can download data sheets, application notes, and more information about these sensors. When you're ready to do your product design around these sensors, and you're faced with questions about how to optimize the use of sensors, how to select the right magnets, please reach out to us. We are more than happy to work with you. Please send us an email at appsupport at kotorelay.com. We'll respond to you straight away and help you along your way. Thanks so much.